You doing okay? That's a pretty big kid. Okay, unstraddle him. Ready? Lift. What we're gonna be doing is grabbing bigger size kids. It's a little unorthodox way of doing this. We're gonna grab the bigger kids and bring them home for a little weaning. Yep, there's a little Billy kid. He needs to come home, home on the range. Oh my Jesus! Oh, and he concussed himself. Okay, not that one. So look for orange tags that are larger. Um. Oh, um, leave that one for a second. Actually, never mind, I lied. Oh, I missed it, I missed it, I still missed it, okay. Yeah, we'll use the feed. Oh, okay. Rated R. friend, everyone be calm. Get in. Thank you. Okay, so yeah, so here we are. That's Sandy. That's Sandy. Okay, I'll... I gotta get the GoPro. It's a little angled. Melissa's ready, man. Man, we could feed the children and get it. Get your friend. God damn it! This stupid GoPro keeps falling. <laughs> Pretty big kid. Okay, unstraddle him. Ready? Lift. Everyone be friends. All right. Can you lift yours up here? I think that might be our max capacity. Front. 
that uh, didn't want to come up because they were like, no, no thank you, bye. <laughs> yes. That's all right, that's a good load. Ah. Oh, speak of our, here, I'll hold it like this. Um, our uh, ah. favorite ranch hand will be 21 this Wednesday on the 12th of June. Yay. Well, <laughs> what time were you born? I don't know. Okay, well, we'll just say it was at 310 in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> so at 310 in the afternoon, everyone take a shot from Melissa. Hell yeah. Party it up. <laughs> <laughs> All the goats will get extra food in, uh, yeah, or they'll get extra food for, uh, what's it, Melissa's party. Okay. Yeah, here's our ram. Girl, full blast air. Hell yeah. Okay, so here we are. Um, these, this is a fresh pasture to the goats. They're old pastures here on the right. And I'm gonna just show you just kind of what it looks like before. Of course, we've got all this weeds and uh, grass and whatnot. And the goats aren't too crazy about grass and stuff, but you can see it's thick. Uh, there's not a whole bunch of briar in this sp specific section, but they haven't hit this low hanging brush. But if we look over here, you can see that anything low hanging was gotten and eaten and everything else. So that's a great before and after shot. We can look to the right, you can't really see through it. Um, can't see through it at all. By the time they're done, we'll be about eye high and down. It'll be see through kind of like over here. Of course, you know, they'll leave back the thick stuff like the sticks and, you know, thick vines, but uh, for all the foliage, it's already been pulled off. It lets a little more sunlight in and gets rid of those invasive plants and things like that. So that's a great representation of just how much work the goats do. See, she, if I wouldn't have stepped up, that she would have been eating on this little tree. They'll eat most of this tree and he'll just have a tiny top. Uh, and so he'll only have leaves at the very top and it should make him want to go up or they might kill him. But the landowner here said, go ahead and knock down as many trees as you want. You know, let them eat all the little stuff. I don't care, let them clear it out. So there's some thick brush over here that they haven't cleaned out yet. They've just started coming to the backside. Today was a little bit cooler than it has been lately. We've been 100, almost 100 degree days and today was about 80 degrees with the sun gone. So this is overcast. Um, so all of this will get cleared out. There won't be any briar vine there with leaves. And so this side, you can see with the amount of rain we're getting, some of the little leaves are coming back, but it's not nearly as thick as it was. So if, once it comes back a little more, we can always pop the girls back over on that side and hit it again. It's not a one and done deal, but uh, they definitely tear it up while they can. Uh, so here's Dory. She's one of the main supervisors here. And so they're going to leave now because I don't have anything good for them. And I am pulling kids out. So I've got everyone kind of on alert. It looks like some we got a couple does in heat with mounting. Here's Rip. He's su he is supervising this section. We got a couple of those in heat. So we could probably put a billy in and maybe get some nanny's bread or some of these younger nannies. But yeah, so here we are. And they're gonna go to town and get this all taken care of. Natalie's here with me this time. Come on, girls! It's uh, pretty muddy out. We got an inch and a half of rain this morning. Um, so, this is not, I don't know where everyone is. What? That one, that one. No, no, no. It's all the orange tag one, but the small orange, like that's not a, like that little one right there, that one won't go because he's new. He's way younger than everyone else. But where's everyone else at, Natalie? This is not who I need. At the pond. Stop saying that. We almost died in the creek bed crossing it because it's so my slick. Life, my eyes flashed before my life. Almost died. Your what flash? What? Say that again. I flash. My life flashed before my eyes. There you go. Okay, so well, uh, good. there's my sheep over there, so that's good news. Um, there's, see, Ruby's not here. Oh, Ruby's over there. She's right there, little hussy. She's in the back. Okay, we're gonna give him some feed and catch who we can. Here's where the goats have been stripping them skeet bark. 
and they've picked most of the leaves off of these like prickly bushes. Um, you can see that a lot of the foliage has been picked off where they could reach in their old pasture that we just moved them from. So that doesn't have a lot of leaves. Of course it's gonna grow back. We're getting a lot of moisture. Um, but they really did a number on this stuff. You can really see through it. And so they did a really good job of uh, clearing out this pasture. And now I'm walking through here, just looking at it and making sure no one got left behind. Um, I, walking up on the pond now, it's been pretty hot, so I figure mostly if anyone did get left behind, they'd be pretty close to the water on these 100 degree days, about 100 degree days, which feels like with humidity. So I don't see anyone, at least not yet. So, so here's the pond. This is what their water source was. It's a big, big pond. So you can tell they really did a number on these little cedars as well. Um, really went to work. What, what is your opinion <laughs> on Goat Ranch? I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> Do you see? My cheeks are red and I'm brown. My legs hurt. I got stung by bull now. <laughs> Not for a week. <laughs> I want to go inside and shower. <laughs> in the air conditioning. Where do you live? In Dallas. <laughs> we have indoor plumbing. <laughs> we have indoor plumbing. Not out here. You, you go to the bathroom in those woods. I did earlier and I'm probably going to get poison ivy. Yeah. yeah. Do so you see how grody that pond is? <laughs> So what are we about to do, Maddie? Take down the fencing. But I'm gonna fake an injury. <laughs> oh, my, my knee's hurting, Tyler. You're fine. So I think we should do two and then call it a day. We'll and then come back tomorrow. We'll just do a couple. Two is a couple. <laughs> okay. Can we just lay it down or we have to pick it up today too? We have to pick it up today too. Maddie wants to die. I do. This is a fake smile. It's hidden behind. <laughs> There's tears underneath it. <laughs> Um, so Maddie hasn't been here in about a year. We've expanded significantly in what we do. Uh, so now we're going to show her how we do this. So first things first, we're going to unclip these temporary posts off this. Yeah, I'm going to start over here. Okay, look, hold on. Let me show you. Just take it. I know we have those. Oh, okay, good. Yeah. Okay, Maddie knows what's up. The ground's a little hard now. It's hot. No. Here's Maddie taking it down. And then I'm just gonna set this right here. If it will go in the ground, see what I mean? We just had how many inches of rain? It's only been a few days, and the ground's already hard. If that tells you anything. Hold on, girl. We gotta undo this. Oh, I forgot that one. Okay, well, I, I can't hold it and do this, so I'm gonna have to sit the GoPro. You want me to hold it? No. That was, I don't want to do it. But we're gonna make a farmer out of you, yeah, Madeline? No, thank you. I'll pass. I like the city. <laughs> okay, we took down six. So originally you said two. I know, but then I kept going. I was trying to get yeah, away told, from you. You get in a rhythm. Yeah, it wasn't that bad. So what did you see? I saw a lizard and some bird tracks and a couple spiders. So you gonna be prepared for tomorrow? I work tomorrow. Right here. In, in the Dallas. So we have the rest of this side to do. We have two more on this side, but I didn't want to kill Maddie. So we'll finish that tomorrow. And then this side and there's another side. So it's like a- I'm Trying okay. to get home to care for this goat. Uh, there's an L. So we'll get those done. There's probably about 15 more, maybe. Maybe. That yep. wasn't that bad. That only took us, what, 20 minutes? Yeah, it's pretty fast. I told her it would take probably three hours with all the breaks that she wanted. Um, but, you know, here's a dog print. That's probably a coyote. Coyote! Oh, oh, oh! 